I forgot his name. Calm down, son. It was your first time. Overall, you did great. I did not mean to let you down, father. No worries. There's one more lesson I have to teach you. I told you, Miss Lane, that's all we know so far. All right, well, what do you know about those guys Superman brought in today? As much as you do. Nothing special about them, just ordinary street thugs. Do you think that's due to the lack of security you've had recently? All right, listen, everything is fine. There's no need to draw this out any further. Excuse me. No, Miss Lane, everything is just fine. I thought I heard him say, Metello escaped? How did you hear that? I have pretty good hearing. Who's Metello? Uh, John Corp. That man, uh, Superman brought in, apparently that's what he calls himself. So you had two breakouts in just a few days? Thanks for the update, kid. You don't even seem that worried. Maybe escaping from prison isn't so hard these days. What are you getting at? <laughs> she, she's not getting anything. Else. Thank you for your time, son. You sure showed him, Lois. Thanks, Jimmy. Sometimes you gotta do that to get the good stories. But remember, a good reporter doesn't get great stories. A good reporter makes them great. Speaking of which, we should probably get back to the plan and get started on this. Yeah, you know what? Why don't you guys head there? I'll meet up with you in a little bit. Clark, wait! Just a little bit ago, you were telling me why you're always running off. And now you're leaving again. I oh, know, Lois. I'm really sorry, but I'll make up to you later. He sure is one busy guy. He sure is. So you're telling me, with these glasses, everybody thinks I'm this Clark Kent guy. That's right. And no one will figure it out. Trust me. No one will know. <sighs> Seems way too easy. Yes, I was rather upset at myself for not realizing it before. Excuse me, Mr. Luther, but why would he be dressing up like Clark? Maury, please tell me you're joking. I don't get it. Because Clark Kent is Superman, remember? We found that out last time we went up against him. We tested Clark with kryptonite. But he said he wasn't. He was lying. Why would he tell us? Why would he lie? Because. Never mind. Have Blades explain it to you later. So how'd I do, boss? Fantastic. That's great. But, uh... We're Superman. Blades. I'll explain it to him later. All right. Now go to the Daily Planet and have fun. Yes, father. You know, I'd like to get a little bit closer to that Lois Lane. She's pretty hot. Don't. Don't you dare disrespect her. Do you understand me? Yes, father. I'm sorry. But what if Clark shows up when he's there? Well, Mattello, you're gonna have to go downtown and do your little thing. Only, we can't have the other Superman learn about you just yet. So we're gonna have to call for some extra help. Blades, take care of him. Yes, boss. Now, go get him, son. Yes, boss. CK, up high! Jimmy, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Sorry, kid. What are you, Clark? Made of steel? No, but Johnny is. Huh? 
Olsen, get in here! What's the matter with you, Clark? You could have broken his arm. <sighs> He's fine. It's no problem. No problem? Well, I hope wherever you went off earlier sure paid off, because we really gotta get started on the story. Weren't you wearing a brown jacket? Uh, I, I got a coffee stain, and, you know, I represent the paper, coffee stain, paper, you know, what story? The Lex Luthor story? What is the matter with you? I guess I just wasn't thinking. And why is that? Because I was thinking about you. Well, I guess that makes up for earlier. Slow down there, Smallville. We have a lot of work to do. Come on. Hey, you two! Get in here! What do you want? What do I want? What I want is a story! Chief! Now all I got is a headline and a bunch of unanswered questions from the sergeant. I'll get my answers and you'll get your story. Better happen soon. Ken, you listening? Uh, yeah. I'll be right back. Where are you off to? I'm off to get your story. Clark, I'll call you later. Come on, Ken. Pull it together and start working on your story. Ah! What is it? Uh, nothing! Ah! You don't scream for nothing. You okay, CK? I'm, I'm fine. I'm, I'm, I'm going to work. That boy sure is strange. Hey, Chief. I thought I told you to go to work. What are you talking about? I just got here. Now don't mess around with me, son. You just walked out of here. I did? He knows who I am. Of course he does. He's the chief. No, the... Chief, where's Lois? She said she was going to go get her story. I gotta go. They're gonna have very strange children. Well, how'd it go? Weird. Why? What happened? Well, my x-ray vision gave out for a little while, and when it kicked back in, let's just say it wasn't a pretty sight. Well, the first prototype, there are bound to be malfunctions. But trust me, you'll be fine. Maury. Yes, Mr. Luther. Are Blades and Metello down at the docks? Yes, sir. Good. Everything's going according to plan. Son. Yeah, Dad. Dad? I mean, father. That's better. Go down to the docks and make sure that everything goes smoothly. Yes, Father. Well, I was thinking, should I be out saving people? No. You'll do as I say, do you understand me? Yes, Father. Kids. I'll do whatever I 